I think that SWE gave me permission to be proud that I'm a woman in engineering, that I'm one of the first women in uh, my technical organization that I joined um, IBM in, and to be able to influence the next generation of engineers. And so I think I've you know, made a lot of difference for um, other women in IBM. I you know, was a first co-chair of um, our first women in, women's network in in my organization. I was very an advocate for diversity and all of the work that I did in SWE helped me, you know, provide those opportunities to others in my workplace and in my life. I think making history through SWE, I have three daughters. They've been coming to SWE conventions since they were probably five years old. Um, I have one, one daughter who's now an engineer and I think that makes history. I have another daughter who's in the technical field in IT, that makes history. I have a daughter who's a teacher and she's teaching our future engineers. I'm an engineer from the early 70s, so there weren't very many women around and our local SWE chapters in New Jersey were very helpful, very encouraging. You saw faces of women who you know, were already out there and making a difference and that helped me a lot and really encouraged me to stay in engineering because I actually was thinking about getting out. So, um, so now here I am, decades later, I'm Vice President of Technology for a major Fortune 500 company, Emerson, and uh, it's made a, a huge difference having the examples, and so now try to give back, be the same for what I got from other women. SWE makes history every day and creates opportunities for our members every day by partnering with the employers, with the academic institutions that create job opportunities for women, create ec um, educational opportunities for women, and actually bring the value of diversity to all they do in the engineering profession. That value of diversity uh, leads to more creative solutions, innovation, and that's how we're gonna solve the major problems of the 21st century.